Coffee Chat Day 13, I believe. Uh, so yeah, I wasn't able to record one of these yesterday, unfortunately. So I'm going to make up for it by recording two today. And in the second one, I'm probably going to be a little bit more energetic just because I'm, you know, going to be two coffees deep. Excuse me. Uh, I mean, not that two coffees is what it takes for me to, like, get wired off of caffeine. Like, it takes a lot more than that. But, you know, like, two coffees will have me a little bit more, like, yippee, I suppose. So yeah, I missed yesterday, uh, not because of, dude, I'm spinning tobacco everywhere. So yeah, I missed yesterday, uh, just because I didn't really get a chance to record. I was going to record, but, you know, like, family came in, and I don't really need them thinking that I am insane and just talking to myself in my room because they don't see the camera. They don't know what I'm doing. So, you know, I, I don't really want them thinking that I'm, I've actually just lost it because they probably already thought that before. And, you know, it's like, I, I kind of want to maintain this image of being sane in front of my mother and all. So, yeah. That's why I didn't record yesterday. As much as I wish I could say it was because I was fasting for Good Friday. Unfortunately, I did fail my fast. So, you know, like, it, it is what it is. But I am still very regretful that I did fail. I need to, I need to start fasting more. I think that's just, like, the truth. Like, I just need to start fasting more. Because, like, last time I fasted, besides yesterday, was, like, a week into Lent. And I like to think that I did pretty good. Like, you know, I went on a little walk. I, like, you know, I walked in the spirit. I, I, di I fasted from, like, water and food. And I just walked in the spirit to where I was walking. And I don't know if I'm walking, like, I don't know if by walking in the spirit people mean what I think they mean. So, the way I usually walk with the spirit is I will just forget my body exists and I'll just let my spirit move, I suppose. Like, that's the best way I can describe it. It's really, uh, it's something that's very hard to describe. But yeah, that's... Like, that was what I did last time I fasted, uh, and I don't know, like, I, I want to get into fasting more. Like, I want to be a better Christian. I want to honor God more with, like, the way I live. I want to be more like Christ, I suppose. That stole it. That uh, went out. So yeah, you know, like I I think every Christian wants to be more like Christ, but yeah, like be trying to reach perfection is very uh very difficult. So outside of Christianity I went to the gym today. Probably not surprised if you, you know, watch these coffee chats, but I I do like to work out quite often. Uh, had a pretty good workout, I won't lie. I finally hit 17.5 kilo bicep curls for a set of eight with decent form. Like, you know, I wasn't swinging it like a madman. First time I got a pump from lifting the 17.5s too. So you know I'm feeling very uh, 
feel very good about that. Like, I feel like I'm actually starting to make more progress. Because I've been, like, stagnant for a while on most of my lifts. So, you know, ha like, having something where it's like, okay, I'm actually going forward in what I'm doing is pretty awesome. Also, uh, one of the first Coffee Chat video apparently has 35 views, so thank you so much for that. I don't know how it got that many views, because, you know, like, it, it's just me having a coffee, but, hey, like, you know, I, I try to make these, like, I try to make these so that in the morning, when people are having their morning coffee, they can just sit down and, like, you know, we can sort of have, like, a back and forth almost. But, you know, like, it's very hard to have a back and forth over, like, this format. Which is why I really want to grow this channel so I can, like, actually do live streams with a bunch of people and we can, like, have that back and forth. I think that would be awesome, but, you know, like, it's just so, it's less lonely when you're having your morning, like, coffee and all. You get me? My granddad's birthday tomorrow, getting him a nice sirloin steak with some pepper sauce. Because, you know, like every time I'm at my grandparents and like my cousins and all are over, uh, he's always like, you know, bringing up steak. And like, especially since one of my cousins recently had a child. Uh, so he's always like, saying to the baby, you know, like, how when you're talking to a baby, you're, like, trying to get them to say something, like, you know, do you want their first word to be something that you said? So, you know, my granddad's always saying to, like, the baby to give him a steak, you know, like, not to give my granddad a steak, but, like, you know, he's talking to the baby, like, tell them to give you a steak, you know, like, all that sort of stuff. And, like, you know, my granddad likes steak, so I want to get him a steak. Now, when you say steak a lot, it really doesn't sound like a word. I mean, I suppose that's with any word, really. So, yeah, I'm going to be doing that after this. Uh, I need to clean up my room, too. Like, you don't see it, but, like, there's just rubbish here. Like, it is very messy, but, like, hey... You know, it is what it is. So, you know, I'm gonna clean up my room. And then, after that, I know, I'm probably gonna eat dinner. And, you know, just chill out for the rest of the night. want to get my laptop working here. Uh, there's a laptop here, by the way. Like, just straight below the video. Want to get that working? Maybe hop on some Minecraft. That'd be pretty sick. Uh, yeah. I also want to write a poem. Like, I I was just thinking about this, like, literally right before recording. Like, I was just thinking of, like, this poem in my head that I was just sort of spitballing in my mind. And I really want to make it because, I don't know, like, it just, it feels like the right thing to do right now to just make a poem. Probably gonna record a bit of guitar too to like go behind it and you know like give it that slight bit more of a vibe. Might upload it actually. I don't know. I, I just fucking might. <laughs> ah. Anyway, uh, yeah, no Easter tomorrow. That. That's pretty sick. The day that Christ rose. 
So yeah, after Easter, I think that's the end of Lent, and after Lent, I am I am locking in on this bulk. Like I'm, like you know, I've been trying my best to stick to Lenting rules, but as I've said before in one of these coffee chats, like I I failed my penance, which was to give up smoking. Uh, I failed after nine days, which you know, like I'm I'm pretty proud of that, like. That's nearly a quarter of the way through Lent. So, I'd like to think that I at least did a decent job. But, you know, like, old habits die hard. Uh, I do want to quit smoking this year. I will quit smoking this year. I know that for a fact. But, you know, like, I like to think I did somewhat decent during this Lent. Like, I like to think that I stuck to the fasting rules pretty well, but I also know at the same time that I, I fucked up a lot. So, you know, like, I really want to... Next year, I really want to give it my all, and I really want to actually succeed at what I'm giving up, and, you know, actually feel more connected, fast more, you know, like, I want to do all that sort of stuff. But, that's, yeah, that's next year, I suppose. But I will be preparing myself throughout this year. You know, trying to get closer to God, obviously. And, yeah. I still need to get, like, a physical Bible just so I can, like, do the gospel reading that I want to do on this channel. Which will mean, like, three videos in a day. Which... I suppose that's good. I don't really know. Like, I feel like I'm playing more of a quantity over quality game. But at the same time, I like to think that what I'm doing is still, like, quality. Like, you know, doing this to try and, like, build more of a connection. Doing this so that, you know, people who are having their morning coffees can sit down and, like, enjoy a coffee with someone online uh the advice videos obviously because i think the advice i give is actually good i mean i hope it's good at least like i hope my advice is influencing people to want to improve and like be better and then yeah the gospel reading will just be like i don't know if you're a new christian you can stop by you can Watch someone reading the gospel and hopefully you'll be able to take some knowledge from that. And like if we get, I mean the the gospel's like full of, well the Bible's full of like good life advice I'd say. Because you know it's the word of God obviously it's going to be filled with good life advice. And I really hope like even non-Christians will be able to get something out of it. Excuse me. So yeah, like, you know, I have a plan. I have a plan moving forward. And I hope that I'll be able to succeed in that plan. And if I don't, then I'll probably do something else. And, you know, like if I keep failing over and over at the things that I try... I know for a fact that I will find something eventually that will work for me and that will help me do what I want to do in life. Sorry, just looking at my... Uh smoking like tally wall i also yeah for new viewers i have like a wall full of sticky notes that just have like tally marks for every smoke i have actually i think i need to write down yeah so as of today we have six smokes so you know i've been up since around 8 a.m that's the latest i've woken up in like the past three weeks 
So, you know, like, not, not feeling too good about that, but at the same time, that extra rest probably is good. Even though I feel like I've been getting sufficient sleep, like I've been getting eight hours most nights. But you know, like, getting that little bit extra sleep probably is helping me a bit more. But I want to stay to the schedule that I have because I like waking up early during the summer. Like, during the summer, I, I love waking up early. During the winter, too. And pretty much every time I like waking up early. But, you know, like, sometimes that can be a bit hard to do. And sometimes you'll, like, have those days where you feel restless around bed and you want to stay up all night. You know, like, that's, like, it's fine as long as you actually still do what you want to do when you're awake. Like, I, I hate to shit talk Hamza again in one of my videos, but... As of recently, he's been really, like, he's been acting cringe about waking up early. And it's like, come on, bro. Like, you, you're you staying up for the same amount of time as everyone else. Like, people can get what they want to get done if they're waking up at, like, 10 a.m. And going to bed at, like, 2 a.m. People are still, like, like, they have the same amount of time awake. They can still do what they want to do. And they can still, like, take steps forward to success. But, like, you know, he's being like, Oh, I make 200 times more than you and I wake up earlier than you. It's like, okay. So what? <laughs> you get me? Yeah, overall, I feel like Hams has really fallen off. And for people that don't know who Hamza is, he's like a self-improvement YouTuber. Used to be really good. Used to be incredible. Like, he, like, not to glaze after shit-talking him, but he, like, genuinely changed how I live my life. And is the reason that I'm talking to you right now. Which I suppose is why it's, like, so disheartening to see how much he's fallen. But hey, like, money will do that to you. Like, success and all will do that. Coffee down. That's all I have to say today. Keep running when no one else is.